Well, well, well. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you new. Hey, bruh. I'm about to start bringing some content talking about some shit that really matters. And I'm going to title them Real Talk. So this will be whatever I'm talking about. Real Talk number one. And by the title of the video, y'all see, we about to hop on this Evo shit. And what then came to the light. So, Evo 2020, 20, I can't talk. 2020 has been canceled twice in one year. First time because of COVID. Second time, this motherfucker a whole pedo, bro. Come on, man. Come on, dog. In my Labusi voice. What the fuck is wrong? And you want to know what tripped me out? Let me tell you what tripped me out. Is these damn YouTubers with these platforms, bruh. I'm talking about a million, two million, three million subs. And how they just respond to shit. Motherfuckers will be like, well, I don't really want to give my opinion. Even though they video is titled. After this shit, I don't like getting my name in drama. I don't like drama. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, bro, it's a thing about being right and being a righteous person and having a platform to address shit when it needs to be addressed. And, not, and I don't be understanding what's up with you motherfuckers. Like, y'all scared to say what's right. How you scared to say what's right? Oh, because it might affect your pockets? Don't... You know what I mean? Don't let us find out you then turn the blind eye to the motherfucker that lines your pockets because of that bottom line. <laughs> Cause I, I know that's how you motherfuckers be giving it up. Motherfuckers are turn the blind eye, just turn away. You know a motherfucker doing some shit he ain't got no business doing. Especially on this type of level. And you don't say nothing. Cause it ain't nothing to pull up videos where you shaking the nigga hand. You mean to tell me you didn't know? Cause it is possible for you to be friends with some motherfuckers and don't know the type of shit they into. And it is that 50% chance that you do know, but a motherfucker help you get into position. So you just go on here and just let it fly. Like, ain't no telling with some of these niggas, bro. It ain't no telling. But yeah, this motherfucker got knocked. This is the type of shit niggas get knocked for these days. Being pedos. And shit like that. Now what motherfuckers should be doing is taking the time to talk about mental health. You know what I'm saying? Because motherfuckers be having mental issues, bruh. Like for real, for real. This shit is serious. Motherfuckers don't want to talk about it, so let's talk about it. Please seek some help, man. Please seek some help. A lot of like people be having weird fetishes and shit. If you gotta hide, sneak, and do some shit that you know you're not supposed to be doing, you need to go get you some help. People be scared to talk about it and all this other kind of shit. Cause I don't know if it's just me, but when I first seen dude, he looked weird. You know what I'm saying? He looked creepy. He just look creepy. Like he do sneaky shit. He just look like one of them. Man, that shit's sad, man. It's real sad. And they got victims out here, so nigga try to get ahead of the game. Issue not his apologies and shit. When a motherfucker issue out an apology like that before the investigation really, really go underway, you feel me? You guilty. You 100% guilty. And you need to be picked up. All this, you know what I'm saying? All this shit about you apologizing, you've been trying to change. How we know that? We ain't see you do no bid. We ain't see you win no kind of, you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, you better bring some paperwork talking about you started your rehabilitation process. Other than that, man, you gotta, it gotta be consequences for you. Motherfuckers be really predators, bro. You a predator. And that, it is what it is. It is different type of predators preying on somebody or something that's weaker, smaller than you. You know what I mean? Don't have the same mental capacity as you and you get off, yo. You know what I mean? And you get off on it. 
You like that kind of shit. Then you find out 20 years later that shit come bite you in your motherfucking ass. Oh, you thought you got away, huh? Because all it takes is one person to come forward and guess what? Everybody else going to be like, hey, wait a minute. This happened to me too. Oh, Lord. Now you done got 30 people all having different stories around the same shit because motherfuckers be lying, nah. That's why investigations got to come out. But if you come out and be like, you apologize, which one of those are true? Because at that point, it don't even matter. You done came out and issued an apology. Shit. That's your ass. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, mental health, bro. If you struggling with something, seek help. It's different types of mental health issues. It ain't got to necessarily be you got to sexual fetish you ain't you know what i mean it'd it be deeper than that go get you some help now look how the public view you you done lost your career nobody fuck with you like that's crazy man that's crazy motherfuckers already don't live by no code a lot of you niggas ain't got no honor no respect feel me think you can do whatever whatever it is you want to do and it ain't no consequences be like only god can judge me yeah yeah all right yeah he most definitely will do that too motherfuckers still act like they don't understand how the universe works you know what i'm saying but i, I know this though because it's always motherfuckers in power it's always motherfuckers in power. And you see what's the topic now. Hey, it's getting out of hand. And for all you religious folks, how about y'all pray for the people that's fighting a fight? Y'all scared to fight. How about that? Say a prayer for the people that's out here saying what needs to be said. You know, some of y'all niggas hide behind religion and be scared to fight the fight. I'm just being 100. You know what I mean? We on the same team. But you fight the fight your way. We gonna fight the fight our way. We gonna go ahead and get some of you boys on up out of here, man. Because y'all plaguing this world unbelievably. And it's so bad now to where it's so set up. Motherfucker gotta go to work. When you start getting them bills, oh my God, we all slaves. I can make a whole video on that itself. Motherfucker turn the blind eye cause, oh man, I need that money. Oh, I need that job. Oh, I need that. Y'all let a lot of shit slide. He knowing what the fuck be going on. Not only is you knowing, you a part of it. But yeah, look my boy Lyle, man. This my boy. Y'all be doing my nigga dirty. Y'all don't understand the concept of this character. And I look at him completely different from how I used to look at him. And I play him different now because my understanding, my comprehension of him is different now. I'm going to make some videos on it talking about it. And how to condition motherfuckers and all that shit. How to play the mind game. A lot of y'all don't know how to play the mind game with him. But yeah, man. Man, I got so many topics I can start talking about. And I can talk. Motherfucker wanted me to be a part of his podcast. So you know me. Like, I just don't turn nobody down without doing proper research. And everybody that was talking in between every four or five words. Motherfucker can't even get a full sentence off. He talking about some, um, um... And then, yeah, that happened. And then, um, I can't do it, bruh. Man, if you talk like that, you need to take notes. Write down what you need to write down. And say what you gotta say. Then pass the mic. Because all this um shit, that's a pet peeve of mine. Like, I, I can't just listen to somebody say um 24-7. I can't do it. Then you're not even making no points. It's like you wasting time in between all these ums. But when it's some bullshit, you talk about that, no problem. But anyways, bruh, I don't think I got nothing else to say. It sucks 
Evo 2020 been canceled twice this year. I know people was looking forward to that shit. I was actually looking forward to watching it. Cause I'm getting to an age to where participating in it is not really a thing for me. I just like watching, seeing the young boys go crazy on some of these games, man. But yeah, that's all I got to say. Oh, I might have more videos talking, so let's get it.